Okay, here we go, guys. Today I'm going to make carpaccio. Carpaccio is uh, actually Italian word. This is uh, carpaccio meaning is uh, thin slice, very thin slice. This is the meaning of it Italy word carpaccio. So I have in the nice tenderly piece. You can see the nice one and uh, Australian black and blue tenderly. And you can see and uh, so I am going to right now clean it and after that I will make the carpaccio and uh, until the end of the video you can see in the nice uh, this is for the carpaccio at least actually it is uh, Italian starter raw beef with some rucola tubes and parmesan and uh, some balsamic reduction and uh, truffle oil and we can see how well I am going to start to clean the pendolin and uh, after that how it's going to process these whole things and now we take pendolin so I start to clean this is the this is calling pendolin one part I will cut my hair so I cut it I put in the off cut here this is my off cut I can use it for the off cut for the templates or something burger you can use for the burger it's actually very good for the burger for the off cut for the actually angus burger you can make in a nice angus burger for the off cut so I take it in the top and go it in the back and you can keep in slice knife like that and you can just start to clean it for the beef and I don't want to see the outside fat for the tender leg so you can clean nicely for the white part you can see if you're getting close to the videos and uh, you can see in the like a nice marble so and uh, this outside pet I don't want and so I clean it nicely and uh, actually if you are going to clean the tenderling you don't want very sharp knife also and if you also are going to clean in the very sharp knife it is difficult to clean the tenderly. So normal sharp knife and you can clean this nicely. So this tenderly this is head part. I don't want head part because of little bit toughness in the head for head. And uh, that I will cut that head part. I don't want head part and I can use for the actually I can use for the tenderly or like a minced beef or something like a burger. I can use this part. So you can see the how I am going to do it and I cut it there and put knife in the down if you are getting close the video close the video and uh, I keep knife and I straight in the I put in the down the chopping board I will start to do like that so I remove this one at least it is I keep clean it after I don't want right now in the top this one and you can see it's nice clean, nice clean in this one, in the top, nothing any damage, you can see, you catch, and uh, nothing damage, and still I have some fat is there, I will clean this one, so nicely, very careful, so I don't want to waste my meat, anything, to make the carpaccio, so, Almost I clean it finish and I will tell I don't want to tear part for the carpaccio and I will cut tear part like that. Okay, I will now almost I have nice clean it and running for the carpaccio. So I will cut in a little bit head also. So you can see the nice still have some fat.
cleaning finish it's nice and clean and no pet nothing and uh, now already clean it now season time and you can see in the after that uh, how is the end in the situation right now already clean it and ready to take care right now here we go now already clean uh, tender in heavy and i cut tail and head already and uh, i have a middle part of tenderly and very nice pieces and so uh, actually i am not seasoning anything for right now and i may want to make the pieces this one and some people putting uh, i can put in the marination like uh, chop garlic chop parsley uh, chop parsley or herb something and black pepper salt and pepper some people make this one doing in the seal and this is the my way of how i am making the carpaccio and uh, you can see how i am making the carpaccio and i have a cream film over there and uh, you can see in the cream film and uh, so i have a nice pieces i keep like that in the nice pieces in there cream film and start to roll it for a nice way to roll it so you can start like rolling i need very tight very tight for the carpaccio already done preparation done and now i putting in this one piece up for the like until get the portion and to get the heart and i put in the piece up like uh, you can get after 12 hours this one getting a piece and after that uh, we will see in the uh, how we'll going to prepare it in the carpaccio okay here we go this carpaccio already portion and already 12 hours we keep it in the piece up already portion and i'm going to remove the cream film and you can see how i'm going to remove the cream film so the proper portion otherwise we cannot cut in by machine so we cut the top portion i cut two sides So oh, here we go. This already I remove the cream film, and now nice portion. You can see how it's portion, and we can cut by in the by machine, and nice shape also. And I will put one one round in the cream film like that. So and I will open like that. So I have slicer here, and uh, nice slicer. And I will show you how to 
Slice. You can see very thin slice, and I have already ready the plate here, and I will start to arrange. Already done one tapacho. Now I want piece again this one and uh, uh, like uh, half an hour you paste this one and after that ready to pick up. I will show in the end how we'll pick up here. Uh, now already done. It's nice clean and no water, nothing. So it is a final touch. We are going to uh, preparation tapacho final touch and. Uh, do you remember I put in the teaser again this one, got it and it. And already fixed this one, already perfect already. And my gun is ready. They are having in the uh, micro lettuce uh, for some eatable flowers. And you can see the some eatable flowers and local lettuce. So it is my mission plus and I have a very thin, fine thin palm sun flex. You can see. So and couple marination, couple smoking cherry tomato I have. This is my way to help make the carpaccio and I have a little salt and pepper and uh, I tell him before when I go to start the uh, preparation before and I tell him I never seasoning any of my meat because of I don't want to get the, my meat this color uh, so now already I have a great nice carpaccio we will see I am going to remove it now and we will see how it will look. Okay, here we go, it is ready. So, uh, 
I will put in the upside down in the plate. You can see, I'm not going to take an array how we need. In the top part here, take the needle. Yes, here we go. See the colors. Can see the color. Very nice and clean. Now, if you so keep in the one uh, 30 seconds, this one big cross is getting getting out and still a little bit having big cross. And when I start to garnish and everything, pick up in time, big cross already. Now, now I start. In my papa, I put in the root leaf first. And then I green color
Chinese starter and Italian starter, you can call Italian for starter. Yes, 